Hello, boys. Thanks, hello, Brian. Here. I just moved to Calgary, Alberta. It's almost Valentine's. And you know what that means? Still cold as our Jesus. It's a day to love or you hate. Some people smell love in the air, and some people just smell bullshit coming from the ghouls. Now boys, stop lying. Valentine's is just for the girls. Why do you think Walmart turns pink for the month? And when was the last time you saw a good Valentine's Day say in a Canadian tile? Valentine's Day should just be called, good luck boys. Now some of you are thinking Cecil, you're old and rotten. What do you know about trapping the girl's doors? And the answer to that is everything. I used to have girls hanging off me like the last jar of mustard pickles. I used to be a love machine. Now the wife thinks I'm a freaking bank machine. It's <laughs> a picture of St. John's there. Look, there's the wife coming in over the harbour. I'm on this here headset now with Skip from Newfoundland Reverses. He got a first date with a lovely girl, and I'm gonna help the poor bugger get a second one. All right, Skip, are you there? Oh, uh, hello? All right, Skip, what I'm gonna get you to do? What the fuck? Shut up while I'm talking, will ya? Listen, you gotta even spot her headset, she's gonna know the state. Oh, uh, I told her these were my air muffs. So don't worry, buddy, she won't suspect a thing. Will you, my love? Oh, you're there with her now, are you? Andy, could we get a, a wider shot on Skip? Jesus Christ, that's a case of beer with a wig on. Buddy! I didn't have enough time to find a real girl. Like, I mean, I went downtown last night looking, and I ended up getting one number. But, uh, it just ended up being, uh, Alcoholics Anonymous. Whatever gets your burr going, I suppose. Now, if anyone out there needs some help this Valentine's Day, get some pen and paper, and start taking notes. Tip number one. If you're in a new relationship, don't be spying or rotten right away. Get her something nice, but nothing too nice. She looks deadly. I'll just get her, like, a card or something. Well, if you get your car, it better be a visa. Listen, take her out for a nice meal. But you don't need to be dropping two or three brown ones for a bit of meat wrapped in bacon. That's fully minion, isn't it? Now they say on the first date you should go out and pay for everything. But you don't want her thinking you're made of money. Let her take the first bill. Oh, was that all on one bill? Yeah. Holy Jesus in the garden tonight! You're freaking right the missus is paying for this. And you want a tip too, do you, my love? Well, here's a tip. Don't buy beer in this friggin' place. Nine dollars a glass. What are you squeezing it out of gold back there or what? Tip number two. Be romantic. Buy her some flowers. Look her right in the face and tell her you love her. Even if you don't, they like that. Missus, I got you these flowers because I think you're right friggin' stock. Now that the evening's almost over, and you and the wife are ready for bed, put on a nice romantic sound. And if you own this instrument, play her one yourself. Shake your ass, watch yourself. Shake your ass, show them what you're working with. Shake your ass, watch yourself. Shake your ass. Show them what you're working with. Attention all ye towny girls, oh Rollies is the place to be. But if you see me wife down here, please stay the fuck away from me. It's hard to keep me head on straight with the flower print on your dress. No stack can't jump with that fine rump. Little mother, come and shake your ass. Shake your ass. Yeah, I'm done.